flying about 5,000 miles this week. After Sun and Fun, we're heading to the Bahamas for a couple days. Before we head, over to, head, head out over the water, I've got my left life vest on. We'll go over a quick little safety briefing. So we've got this lovely uh, life raft right here between the seats. Uh, there, are seats or there are life vests in these seat back pockets and also under that seat. They're mostly under that seat. Okay. Um, in the event of an emergency, uh, you want to open the door before we impact the water or whatever. So to do that, you push the button, rotate the handle clockwise, open it just slightly, then rotate the hand. Don't push the button, rotate the handle back counterclockwise so that it's latched, so that it can't, can't shut again. And the other thing is, is uh, don't get out of your seatbelt until everything kind of comes to a complete stop and you know how to get out of the airplane, because otherwise, if you fall out of your seat, you'll be very disoriented and probably not know how to get out of the airplane. Bimini traffic Bonanza 7 Hotel Pomp is 5 to the north. It's going to be uh, entering the left downwind for runway 2850. Bimini traffic Bonanza 7 Hotel Pomp is left downwind 28. We got the departing traffic. South Bimini. That water is just so nice. It's so shallow out here. Right. Miami Center Bonanza 367 Hotel Pompa. Standby. So the message to the guy who is supposed to pick us up uh, didn't get through. So well, I guess I'll just call him when we get there and hopefully he can get us. Maybe we can call him from the stop Yeah, that would work too. Uh, hear him. Uh, how'd that go? Good. We're, he will have a ride, I think. Hopefully. Okay, cool. A Amian sounds amazing. Amian sounds like a total bro. <laughs> Sergeant Austria, I was wondering if you were still coming, man. Hello? Miami Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa. I think we're just going to forget Miami and yeah, figure out how VFR and the Bahamas works. He's just nine, blown nine, you off so many times now. NASA approach Bonanza 367 Hotel Pompas. Take the transit at 7,500 to Rocktown. Alright, just... Negative flight plan. Contact radio 128-0. Put a flight plan on file. Is that where we were? No, that's apparently I have to file a flight plan or something. I don't know how this... Radio Bonanza 367 Hotel Pompas. Roger, our flight plan has to be on file. Um, go ahead and put the flight plan um, for the information. Roger, flight plan uh, will be on file. Uh, stand by for support code. Okay. <laughs> zero, four zero. Zero, four zero. And that is how you fly VFR in the Bahamas. We will be good right now. Right. We have finals is extending about 30 miles, so it's still so 367 Hotel Pompo, service is terminated, Good night. Good night. Do you suppose we have to close the flight plan? The water just looks so pretty.
nice. Hi, this is November 367 Hotel Papa. Uh, can I close a VFR flight plan in the Bahamas with you? It's fascinating. Then they gave us a, a SWAC code for us. So I, I don't actually know exactly how it works. Okay, awesome, thank you. We got somebody on the west coast, so he's transferring to me to Miami. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be helpful. Yeah, so Miami didn't seem to know it either, but he said he was gonna send a message to NASA telling them that we got here, so we should be all good. Okay, they're helpful. They're crushing it for us. Are you Damien? Yeah. Awesome. We're, uh, we're the group, yeah. Damien, how, how many people live on this island? Not sure. Not sure. There was a frog in the toilet this morning, and uh, now we're gonna go check out the ocean hole. Is your machete part of your business? I think I chugged that water too quickly. <laughs> That's impossible. Uh, no, I just kind of feel weird. The rock sound control area is 700 AGL to 6,000. As to contact NASA approach 121.0. So we're not going to do that. We're just going to fly at 700 AGL. So pretty. Amazing. Super pretty. Matt, I got your text when I got back. I liked it. They said we'll be there in 20 minutes. We've had an incident. <laughs> it, it could mean so many things. It could mean anything. Anything from a frog up to the house burned down. Right. Like a house burned down, I broke my leg, like I'm in the emergency room. I called the one doctor, he's on his way. Right. <laughs> I was waiting for Damien to be like, I'm the doctor. <laughs> <laughs> so we're coming up on Norman's oh, Key, which is this really fun little island. Uh, back in the late 70s, early 80s, it was the headquarters of drug lord Carlos Later. Uh, so some pretty interesting history around here. Uh, but there is still a crashed DC-3 right, just off the coast. So we're going to fly over that, we're going to land. Hey, there's somebody else there. Oh, I see the restaurant. There's, there are two planes. Oh, man. Okay, three green. Capsule forward. So last time we were in Norman's Key, uh, we didn't actually have any way to get out to the crashed DC-3. So we didn't have a boat, it was too far to swim, so this time we decided to bring our own boat, inflate it, and paddle out there. Except that we actually have no idea now where the uh, plane crash is because we can't see it from the ground. But we're going to try to try to find it and see what happens. We have no water. We, we also <laughs> have no dying. water. We're currently going two knots. 
Yeah. yeah, we're just trying to go see the wreck. It's so strong. We're from Boston, but we flew in an airplane and we brought this little raft out. Okay, so you're land based. Yeah. I don't want any boats. Yeah. Okay, well, be careful because that current gets you. Oh, yeah. That stop is Andrews. Could you give us a tow out there? Sure. Yeah. Thanks, man. We basically made almost no progress while rowing. And those guys were like, look at these pathetic land based pieces of shit. Are you guys Patriots fans? No. <laughs> Wait, which one should I say? <laughs> no, always say no. Always say no. <laughs> uh, yeah. That was a good adventure. I feel satisfied with that adventure. That yeah, that was good. Yeah. So we just left Norman's Key, and uh, well, here's Brian with an update. So we're leaving Norman's Key. We um, spent some time in an inflatable raft paddling uh, upstream. We made no progress whatsoever, and um, a nice, fine gentleman from South Carolina came and towed us out to the wreck. I'm pretty sure they're from Baltimore. Baltimore, South yeah. Carolina. Somewhere in South the Carolina was the lunch people. Oh, Baltimore. We they, met lots of great people today. They, yeah. they towed us out to the wreck. We spent some time uh, swinging, swimming around it in the current. It was pretty fun. And now we're going to head to Exuma, get some fuel, and then over to San, Sal San Salvador. Should yeah. I mention Christopher Columbus? So it turns out the only restaurant on the island that's supposedly still open this late isn't actually open. So we don't really know what to do, but then we found this lady here and apparently she's gonna give us a ride. So this is an important part, it's, it's not open. It's a it's gambling cafe. Little mobile food van right under the tree here. I hope they're still open. If not, there's a club further on down. Hi, this is November 367 Hotel Papa. We'd like to arrive at 1230. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. San Salvador, my name is 7 Hotel Papa. It's probably on the way 10, San Salvador. Hello, 
Weber 367 Hotel, Papa Miami Center, radar contact 14 miles northwest San Salvador Airport, uh, clear to Fort Pierce International Airport via direct surfing, Sierra Uniform Romeo Foxtrot November, Bahama Route 62 Victor, Angie Direct, climb and maintain 8000. Okay, we're clear to the Fort Pierce Airport via direct Serpent, Bahama Route 62, Victor, Anzi, then direct I mean, uh, climb maintain 8000, Bonanza 367 Hotel Papa. And 367 Hotel Papa, Rebec, correct, and uh, correct, and the climb and maintain flight level 080, use standard ocean altimeter 29992. Okay, we'll maintain flight level 0807 Papa. Can we get the rest of the food before Fort Pierce? Yeah. That's just a perfect size for snacking. We're snacking so hard. <laughs> I haven't snacked this hard in years. Perfect size for breakfast. <laughs> November 367 Hotel Papa Radar services are terminated. This contact Nassau approach 125.3. And if you're able to reach them on 25.3, you can try them on 121.0. Nassau approach beneath the 367 Hotel Papa, flight level 080. 367 Hotel Papa, what's your position? Uh, 367 Hotel Papa is uh, 84 miles from the Nassau VOR on the uh, one zero two radial. At seven hotel Papa, confirm you're requesting a clearance as well, sir. See your destination. Yeah, we're going to Fort Pierce. Uh, we had a clearance from Miami Center. Okay, Roger. Your radar identified just uh, east of uh, northeast of the Rock Sound Airport. Uh, Eight thousand two hundred. NASA station pressure three zero one one. Okay, three zero one one. And uh, we were maintaining flight level 080, you want us at 8,000 now? A affirmative, sir, uh, flight level uh, 080. Uh, do you want the flight level or just 8,000 on uh, 3011? Okay, uh, I'll confirm you on 2992. Yeah, we were on 2992. You can uh, remain on that uh, altimeter setting, sir, and uh, maintain flight level uh, 080. November 367 Hotel Papa, the Miami Center is a little busy. Radar service is terminated and give them a call now on their frequency of 125.7. Maintain and confirm you received the clearance already or uh, you're still requesting a clearance? No, we had a clearance from them and we'll contact them 125.7. Name the 367 Hotel Papa. Good day. Roger, good day. Pierce Tower, Bonanza 367 Hotel, Papa, visual 10 right. Lance, uh, 6 Charlie Hotel, you have a stuck mic, sir. Cessna 84 Uniform, runway 10 right, line up and wait. Line up and wait, 10 right, uh, 10 right, 1184 Uniform. Grab it into 367 Hotel Papa, 14, going to customs. For 367 Hotel Papa, Fort Pierce, go around. Uh, Roger, continue down the runway, sir. Turn right on Charlie 4, straight into customs. Number 367 Hotel Papa, Fort Pierce Tower, runway 32, line up and wait. Traffic landing, runway 10. The Apollo work was done. Out on 23, contact tip of the thing that juts out. The launch complex that uh, SpaceX is using is, um, if you look at the VAB and you go maybe like one clock direction to the right, and you go directly south and you see those complex of buildings, that's where I used to work. Last year on the way to Sun and Fun, we saw the SpaceX launch that ended in the first successful barge landing. Yeah, that was pretty epic. We were, what, about this close, right? Yeah. Uh, All the 3D printed carbon fiber. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you said we're going somewhere close to Charlotte? 
Yeah, it's Mon the Charlotte Monroe Executive Airport. 367 uh, Hotel Pop, contact Savannah 120.4. 120.4, Benny and the 367 Hotel Pop. Good day. I'm going to give you a string of what seems like <laughs> random numbers and letters, but someone that you deliver it to will know what it means. She was like, okay, whatever. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm talking Hotel pump. We were wondering if we could do uh, one turn in holding at the uh, Cambridge VOR. 